all right guys welcome back to our youtube channel for today's video i'm gonna be doing another tutorial for you to watch it's pretty easy for everyone especially beginners in the field of social media marketing and social media management or even graphics or graphic designs so let's start making graphics for our MailChimp email marketing campaign. So for those of you who don't know, I am a freelancer and I'm specialized in social media marketing and management. So today, I'm going to be making a graphics for our MailChimp email marketing campaign as I am assigned to do it. I know for a fact that you can definitely create a content within MailChimp however i just don't like making one inside the platform because it's limited especially when you only have a free account so i want you guys to save money but at the same time be creative and think outside of the box and for me i really want quality graphics and i don't want to limit myself in being creative and i don't want to settle for less that is why i am using canva as my editing platform i wasn't utilizing canva before because i thought that canva is just another random editing website that will never really meet my needs but it actually turned out to be my most favorite editing site i've ever used in my entire career so I started creating a header because I feel like this is an essential part of an email marketing content. It's pretty basic. So I just played with the colors, the shapes, some pictures related to the campaign I am creating and just channeling the inner creative weirdo in me. All right, so now that we are done with the header, let's now proceed to the body of the content, which is the purpose of the campaign. Here, I made two parts. The first part is the problem, and the second part is the solution or the call to action. By the way, this campaign is actually intended for my client who is a realtor. For those who don't know, a realtor helps people buy and sell homes. The instruction given to me is that I have to create something that would draw attention of those people who will receive the email or those part of the mailing list, that's what we call. I decided to come up with a question slogan for the first part that says, ready to buy or sell, because I just want to keep it short and simple the tricky part is actually the type of font style i should use i had so many trials and errors until i came up with something i would say i am satisfied of the good thing about canva is that it has so many styles to choose from even if you are just using the free account now the second part which is the call to action part by the way i use neutral colors because that's what my client requested for whatever industry it is the call to action part is where the solution takes place or you know what to do to get the issue being resolved and because the target audience are the people who are into selling or buying properties or are the people who are into the real estate market, the solution is just by calling Kimberly Johnson for help, for sure. So the last step is adding those graphics we've already created to MailChimp since it's going to be the platform that will run the campaign. The fact that we already created the graphics for the email content, choosing a template doesn't really matter, so I just selected one randomly. We are going to remove and replace the sections, and it's just an easy drag, drop, and upload thing, you know? Thank you. 
for this campaign i did not create a footer and i just feel like it's no longer necessary what i did was i added her social media links instead her facebook website instagram and linkedin profile preview and send tests to see how it turned out and we're done simple